so let's see how to have a result set in java right first thing uh, that we need is what the first step is to import java dot sql dot asterisk right it will uh, import uh, the sql packages then uh, what we need is uh, a connection interface joseph so let's have the instance of it which is connection a couple of statement nevi jaru par se so let's have a statement and uh, we would also require what the result set right so result set bhi apda yahan lai le liye the are now means you no know, instance yahan declare kar le liye now let's uh, load the class class dot for name so as always if you don't know how to import uh, the means how to write the class dot for name to add the com dot mysql dot driver right and it be tumhe lai sako jo so our class dot for name means class to be loaded is ready this is com is package mysql is sub package jdbc is another sub package and this is the uh, class file driver which is to be loaded but in actual if you are doing it with oracle you need to load this driver so i have taken the exception so but the exception jj we are not going to manage rather java is going to manage it see the connection is defined the statement uh, be apne ya declare ke one result set pe along with that we do also require is what the url which is jdbc oracle then localhost and port number with si then the username is this and the password एसक्यूएल क्वेरी अपने लक्ष फॉर अपने सिलेक्शन क्वेरी जो लखी है एना लेस इनिशलाइज द कनेक्शन यूजिंग ड्राइवर मैनेजर डॉट एट कनेक्शन यू आर एल दैन द यूजर नेम एंड द पासवर्ड सो दिस इज द यू आर एल इट इज दैन and the next thing is what uh, to initialize the statement so the statement is equal to connection dot create statement right create statement so the statement is done the next is what uh, we need we must write query to select uh, for selecting data from our table so let's start from student right so the query is also done So now we should use the RS, right? The RS is equal to STMT dot. Now this is the method we are supposed to use for having the valid result set object, which is execute query. And see, this is the return type of. So here this is result set. So execute the SQL statement returns a single result set object. So execute query and the query is there with SQL. So now we can use various methods of RS for retrieving the data. The JRS ni under already virtual table na format ma shay. Let's check a few of the methods uh, of result set like this. Mm, print. Then total right. RS start. result set so let's retrieve a few of the data which is there with rs right you can write like this rs dot get int see get xxx methods are supported by result set now if i say get int means i need to mention the column name column index which is integer data type which is of integer data type less i have mentioned one right because first column jc it is of student number and it is of integer data type 
Uh, let's see what is going to return by the result. And run kariya in the apne. So it has an exception. What it says that next was not cold, isn't it? So it is very smart. Aya get in apne karalu she, but result set is pointing to the beginning of the record set, result set. So aya ek wo khud apne next karta hai wale. So now it is pointing to the first row. Now let's see what is going to happen. I am running this application from here. Start and this is column number. J F to S N O J one I B. Along with that, I need the another column. So what I can do here plus and have the second column. Now second column is of integer. Sorry, the string. And a and column number is two. See the column index begins from one, right? So this is column number one. This is column number two. Let's uh, run this application. So this is one and million, right? And finally, let's have the third column, right? Again, it is a string column. Now let's run the application. One million and Jamnagar. So these are our three columns that we have retrieved over here. See, it has only displayed uh, one set of record. If I want to check the next record, I can do like this. अपने जो आओ करी सकिए। So first record display कर से। This is uh, going to display the second record. Let's run the application and see what is going to happen. One million Jamnagar, two Kyur Rajkot, right? Like this, अपने one by one next करता जाइए। So it will move up to the end. But what is going to happen? के तीजा चौथा पांच बात ये अपने एज्यूम कर लीजिए कि चार वक्त अपने करू पड़े ना व्हाट अबाउट वी हैव थाउजेंड्स ऑफ रिकॉर्ड्स अ स्टेटमेंट आ रही थे रिपीटेडली लखवाना ना होए इंस्टेड वी मस्ट यूज लूप्स राइट अपने एक व्हाइल लूप यूज करी ना बद्दाज रिकॉर्ड्स से ने डिस्प्ले कर दी सकिए लाइक दिस व्हाइल rs. नेक्स्ट मींस एज़ सून एज़ एज़ अब तो व्हाइल जैसे सॉरी आरएस डॉट नेक्स्ट चेयर ट्रू रिटर्न कर से त्यां सुधी सुन करवानूं व्हाट इट इस सपोज्ड टू डू इट सपोज्ड टू गो इनसाइड लूप न दरेक वक्ते लूप मासूं कर से पहलु कॉलम बीजू कॉलम न त्रिजू कॉलम जे डिस्प्ले कर से नाउ लेट्स सी व्हाट इस गोइंग टू हैपन सो दिस आर द सेट ऑफ रिकॉर्ड so see the data is displayed in uh, the console window but it is not in a proper format so you can do like this system let me copy this one for having my headings right which is student number and i'm using uh, one slash t then student name another slash t and city so these are my headings now herein i need to have the step sign so at the eight around spaces per cjj it is going to print that one now let's have one more of this so it is ready now system dot out dot print and this is column number one this is going to be the column number 2 and uh, this is going to be the column number 3 now let's see what is going to be the output of uh, this code right so this is student number this is student name and city though it is not uh, properly indented but we can arrange them right so that's it thanks for watching my video ask your questions in the comment section below subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for latest video notification